What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Overlord here. We're going to be talking about Scary Movie 6 in this video here today, more specifically about Regina Hall. But before I dive into that, we know that a few weeks ago, a few days ago, we found out that the Wayans brothers will be returning to the franchise they helped start back in 2000 to write a new vision for the franchise that is coming back to us sometime next year, I think, even though that wasn't announced. It's supposed to start filming next year with a theatrical release planned. And that got a lot of people excited, myself included, because of the fact that once Scare Movie 5 dropped and you didn't have Anna and Regina around to carry it on their backs anymore, it became evident what the problem was with Scare Movie, and that was that you lost the Wayne's magic touch. Once Anna and Regina were gone, everybody had to recognize that these movies just were not the same. Once that chemistry was gone, everything pointed towards you need to get the Wayne's back immediately to save this franchise. But recently before all of that we know that anna herself came out and stated she would be down under two specific conditions one of which ties into regina and then we got that lovely confirmation about the wayans so we had two-thirds of this puzzle at least being teased that we are going to be getting them back together in some capacity now we have the third edition which is regina herself finally making comments about scary movie six leading everyone to get even more excited about what could be on the way when it comes to this film. So when she spoke with TV insider, Regina, that means she had an interview with them. They made comments about the Wayans brothers announcing the scary movie franchise is returning. I know Anna Ferris said a few months ago, there are two conditions. If she reprised her role as Cindy in scary movie money and Regina Hall, Regina said this, Anna is great. I'm just very excited to know that the Wayans who actually started the project out of their idea are back on board and at the helm again. I'm excited for them. We'll see if Brenda is in the new world or in this new world. I'm thrilled at the possibility that the band could get back together again. That would be fun. Yes, it would be. It would be a lot of fun. But like I stated in my last video dedicated to Scary Movie 6, if Anna and Regina for whatever reason were not able to come back, the saving grace of all of this thanks to what was highlighted from Scare Movie 5 and the fact that they weren't in that one, the saving grace is that the Wayans are back. If the Wayans are back and you fail to get those two ladies back, at least I would have some faith that something special could still be accomplished. It would be unfortunate if it wasn't with Anna and Regina's participation, but I at least will have some sort of hope that the Wayans would deliver something that is hilarious and revives this genre of comedy that has been dead. I would love to see it revived in some capacity. You'll have a lot of people trying to imitate them again, and yeah, they will just be inferior, but it is what it is. As far as what I could see going on in Scare Movie 6 and how you would get Brenda to come back this time, a lot of you tossed around the idea of incorporating Halloween 2018 by having Cindy living in fear, similar to Lori's situation, but Cindy's motivations, I'll just theorize for a second, her motivations can be inspired by everything she went through during those first four movies and that can be a simple way to keep those films canon but cindy's biggest motivation for living like Lori as of late with traps and all this stuff ready to go is because she recently encountered doofy not too long ago and the cops still haven't caught him just like they didn't during his first spree so with doofy still being on the loose and opening up old wounds by running into him again like that that has sent cindy off the deep end and she's out there living like Lori. and her friends think she is just off her rocker they don't think she is living in reality and they treat her like trash one of those friends could be brenda or you could incorporate brenda like this maybe she hasn't spoken to brenda in a while and in a scene that can kind of parody hereditary she runs into brenda at this like PTSD group or something similar to what we saw in Hereditary and one of the people that are around in this group is just Brenda and that's how you can incorporate Brenda you can see their friendship get rekindled she tries to help Cindy overcome her fears of Doofy and all of this stuff and that could be how Brenda gets back involved in this I again will stress that I think the saving grace of all of this is the Waynes being back Regina her presence it's something I can't take away she is like a comedic god when it comes to her performance as brenda meeks but if she is not back i would be fine because of the fact that you got the wayans back and that is what mattered most the wayans being removed was a big part of why scary movie 5 was highlighted to be the train wreck that it ended up being because it was just evident without those two ladies carrying it on their back that you needed to get these men back 
You need to stop pissing around and making all these bad decisions. And now that you have done the right thing, something special should come out of this deal. We don't need to see a scary movie again that is watered down, not afraid to poke fun at things. If you are easily offended, I don't even know how you grew up loving those first two movies. The third one is has literal KKK jokes in it. I don't even know how you grew up loving these movies if Scary Movie 6 and the thought of it is already getting on your nerves, making you sensitive, and you're already upset about it. I don't want to see a watered down scary movie. We need to see everybody be able to laugh at themselves. Everybody be able to just come together, have a good time with the Wayans magic back in the mix. And if Regina is open to it, that's the best news we got this week because it's been a pretty slow week for news. (laughs) I would love to see her back as Brenda. But if she's not back, it wouldn't be the end of the world as opposed to what we saw with Scary Movie 5. It just is what it is. Those two ladies carried this franchise on their back during scare movie four they carried that film if they were not in it scare movie four would be pretty eh it would be pretty eh scare movie five is already eh almost don't want to watch that i ba- i barely rewatch it when i'm doing my rewatches sometimes i just stop at four and then something like eh, you know what i'll turn on five so hopefully with scare movie six we get something special something of quality something that can make everybody just laugh at themselves and not take everything so seriously but you guys can let me know what you think about this down in the comment section below what would you love to see from regina hall back as brenda meeks do you think that regina hall is an actual necessity even if the wayans are back i think that the issue with scare movie was that they lost the wayans If you want to argue that the issue was that they lost Regina, I'd love to hear that argument down in the comment sections and see where you're coming from and see if I can agree. But I think the biggest problem with Scare Movie became evident when those two were gone. It was the lack of Wayans. Let me know what you guys think about all this down in the comment section below. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe, turn on post notifications, check your name this video. In the description, I'll have links to all my social media accounts. I am on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course, to let me know if there are any movies, news, or reviews you would like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.